So today I thought it would be fun to do something a little bit different for a video, and that is I want to tour a local store called Hive. And Hive is an interior design group, and it's a home store. Mike is packing up the car right now. We want to take Emma with us because aside from it have selling really beautiful uh, luxury home decor items, we're talking blue and white, um, all kinds of pillows, furniture, accessories, even personalized stationery. They have a huge children's section. So we think Emma's really gonna enjoy it. So um, without further ado, let's go and tour Hive. We arrived, we're here. This is the side entrance and it is a beautiful day. It's in the upper 80s with clear skies. Also, Hive has an online store, so I'll link that below in case you see anything you might be interested in, it might be online. But let's go in because I wanna show you why this is my favorite entrance. And it's because of this blue and white display right here. I love walking in and seeing all this blue and white because I'm a big blue and white fan. I'm thinking about getting one of those items to hold to use as a crock in my kitchen actually but i like how they have the blue and white on the table and then those that like chartreuse color on the chairs and then they keep the walls and the floors neutral oh so pretty but we're gonna walk through this hallway right here and it's gonna open up into a bigger main area and that is how this whole store is laid out you have really large big open areas but within each area it's sectioned off into like little living room dining room bedroom setups it's perfect for inspiration for your own home here's one of the first setups right here and this is one of my favorites because I love the pom-poms on those pillows this also taught me I should probably get bigger pillows for my couch but I love the artwork on here everything and one thing I noticed in these setups you'll see that the couches are basically the same they just switch up each room by the artwork and accessories and it just goes to show what you can do if you have neutral pieces just how you can switch up your home love these ottomans I think they would be absolutely perfect if they just had some storage but other than that I, I think that they're really pretty they have all these little tables set up with gift ideas that one had some food this one has these candles I thought it was so clever because it says hive and then you have like the beeswax around it I really love those candles and this is just a really gorgeous trinket box I just loves the quality of this box definitely a step up from home goods let me tell you they also had really pretty vases and this is a like a ruffled bowl could be an orchid pot i don't know but on the bottom that price says 595 dollars so i uh i quickly put that down i do not want to break that and then here's another little area right here i like how they use the garden stools instead of ottomans in this living room i thought that was really pretty and they have those blue and white chairs a lot of blue and white i would say they skew more coastal but that's palm beach for you we we love our coastal decor this is the stationary section this is personal customizable and you can get coasters napkins um thank you notes notepads all kinds of things here and i just and i love personal lies stationary i think it makes a great gift and makes me feel extra special when when I'm writing a note and it has my monogram on it. <laughs> this is another section, neutral, except they have the terracotta and rattan going on more in that area. And then over here is, um, I love orchids. I had to get this orchid display. It's a bunch of little ones put together. I thought that was really clever. I did a video on how to take care of orchids though. So I'll link that video for you guys as well. This is just, again, another overview. Oh, and this is the children's section. It's amazing. It's so whimsical and beautiful and colorful yet fun. Look at that chandelier fringe on that really pretty tablecloth. This was like everything I marked from like to know it is in the store. It's kind of like they stalked me or something. I loved everything in here. That is an acrylic crib. That's a little boy's acrylic crib. They sell Nuna here. We're big fans. We have Nuna. We love Nuna. This is the girl acrylic crib setup that they have. I just thought it was amazing. I mean, I wouldn't get Emma one, but I really appreciate it. And then here's Emma playing with all the toys. They have kids' chairs and tents and toys and clothes and just so much. And those little chairs are so sweet. They are going on Emma's 
Christmas list. I want to get her those so bad. She had so much fun playing with all the little wooden toys. Like that's a grill right there and like little skewers and Mike's chasing her around for me so I can film this. This is just some of their, their dresses that they have. And actually the dress that Emma is wearing right now is from Hive. One of my friends got that for her for her birthday, which is so sweet. And she loved this little tent right here. Out of all the tents there, the camper tent was her favorite. But check out that luggage. I love the luggage. This is also uh, just an up close of some of the toys and little um, areas that they have. A very Montessori. I think that's the right word. They have like a lot of Montessori things there. Books, stuffed animals. We just had a blast in this whole section. Now moving from the kid area is the patio outdoor section and I moved kind of fast through this because it, we were approaching nap time so we had to get home but I hope that you can get a good idea of the type of things that were here and how they styled some of the areas a lot of white with bold colors like this pink umbrella with the fringe love that and I love how that table has the slats in it and then over here a lot of white but look at this green wall i love this this is so florida this i just oh gosh i can't get over that green wall back there is a rattan cart with orchids on it if you want the palm beach style get something rattan rattan and orchids i guess <laughs> okay love that lamp wanted to get a little bit of close-up of that lamp but in this area you have more of the bedroom and linen type things so there's sheets and shams and duvet covers and towels all the linens and between it all is this little nook and in here is home fragrance they sell nest and diptyque which is two of my favorite brands i love them both and while i was looking at that i discovered that they also sell the laundress and i love laundress i use their um laundry detergent on our clothes and i love the whole baby line for emma's stuff it just smells so good and it's natural and it gets your clothes like super clean but this is a quick shot of all the um all the good smelling candles that they have this is a little dining room set up on the way out is kind of like the entertaining area where they have more dining spaces and buffet areas and i just love how the store has so many things set up that it's it's actual things that you can do in your own home so if you see something and you like it you can easily style it the same way in your home which is one reason i love coming to the store it's very inspiring and it gives me really great ideas like those green branches back there in that vase we don't have all the really fun fall branches here in florida for in the fall time but in the summertime or because it's florida anytime you could Always cut that those green branches and have them in your home this is William Yoward crystal and I discovered him about a year ago and I really love his crystals I was so excited to see that they were carrying it at Hive again this is just an overview or a tan table that's crazy and but I love the big bowl that they had in the center oh this is actually one of my favorite areas right here I love the hutch with the artwork on either side and that is all I was able to capture. Looking back while I'm editing this, I really wish I was able to get more vignettes for you because there's just so many, but we're kind of short on time having Emma there, although I don't regret bringing her because she loved the kids section so much. But I hope that this was enough to just inspire you, get your wheels turning, maybe even get you out of the house, do something a little bit different. These are just some clips of what I just showed you just as a quick recap and then I want to take you home and show you just a couple small things that Mike and I bought. So we are back from Hive. It is a couple days later and I want to show you guys what I got or what we got for Emma. So we got this toy in here and Emma absolutely adores it we got it home we got it open and she's been having so much fun playing with it but it's all wooden and it comes apart see emma and this looking through the camera with me <laughs> this is just the box she, she enjoys boxes too and then i got her this book because i mean it's just so precious look how cute this this book is 
and I think it'll look so cute on our little bookshelf. Right now though, she's mostly reading the, um, the cardboard books because sometimes she still puts them in her mouth and she doesn't know how to be gentle with the paper ones yet. So this one will probably go on the top shelf, but I love it because this actually has no words. And I remember when I was little before I knew how to read, I loved it when books had no words and just pictures, then I could feel like I could read them. So this is just about a little girl and a flamingo and it's just so cute. Look. Okay, so I think I'll put that on this one because this is like her that she can still kind of hurt and I don't want her to eat. And these are the ones that she can eat and be rough with. And she loves going to it and picking up the books and thumbing through them. And right now I think she's crunching up the receipt. Okay, let me show you actually how fast. I don't know how much time I'll have in this video. But I'm planning on doing like in Emma's nursery tour and organization, but I do have more books up here. I have seasonal books like every fall and winter and Christmas and Valentine's Day. And then I have rotation books and I just rotate the books that she has down in the living room and on her bottom shelf right here. Cause sometimes she gets bored. Oh, now she's in her. Okay, so I gotta go, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you soon. Let me know if you like these kinds of videos. If you want me to go to more stores in the Palm Beach area and I'll see you soon. Say bye. Bye, Emma. Say bye. <laughs> Good job. Thank you.